preparing some of the uh, articulating pod went well. Uh, everyone was able to uh, to confirm that it's working as as designed, so a re-entry into Earth's orbit should not be an issue. But also, while uh, I guess we would say it worked in the uh, on the moon, not not our moon, but the moon in this in this galaxy they're in now, out past Andromeda, um, they did discover something else, and it's actually good, and it's good news because the. Uh, uh, the heat pods, or the, I'm sorry, the, uh, the the panels on the outside of the craft, they're also in excellent condition. And, and this this particular uh, object that they landed on had had an atmosphere similar to that of the Earth. So you know there was a tremendous amount of heat encountered when they uh, when they landed, and the uh, heat shields did a good job protecting that. Uh, fortunately, the uh, the articulating pod was in good enough of working condition to land. Of course, they wanted to land in this uh, in this other galaxy on this on this moon because if they had attempted to land on Earth to re-enter Earth's orbit, and this articulating pod was a problem, it could it could really pose a disaster because this is a rather large craft, and uh, if it if it did encounter issues when re-entering the Earth's atmosphere, it would it would almost be uh, it would be like a tsunami type effect uh, when it as it approached the uh, the ocean out out near Bermuda in that area. That's that's actually where the uh, where the what's referred to as a USO unidentified submersible object. I know there's a lot of rumors out there on the internet about uh, USO bases, this that and the other, but you know that that's one rumor that is confirmed. So uh, when they do re-enter our orbit, when they do land. Uh, they will be landing in that area. Now, of course, I cannot uh, cannot disclose the exact location, but it is it is in the uh, if if you like to uh, if you like to go to Google or or similar search engine search engine rather and search for uh, the location of the Bermuda Triangle, it shouldn't be too hard to find a uh, a graphical representation of that. So that's what's going on. Everything's great. Uh, they they lifted off uh, from this. Uh, Planetary body. I don't know about uh, about three hours ago. So everything's going well. They're back in orbit, and I'll post some additional updates uh, when when they become available. But I mean, as of now, it looks like everything's still on schedule for March of 2012. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll uh, I'll keep everyone posted.